Thanks, thanks for a warm introduction. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. I know this is the last session of the day, but still I believe you can be more energetic. Let's try it out once more. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. That's a lot better. As this is going to be more of a panel discussion, which means that interaction. What I expect from everyone is to interact, ask questions, share your experience uh, you know, with, with cloud, some of the challenges that you have been facing through cloud, why you adopted cloud, and uh, what are the key concerns that you have. So let's have a more interactive you know, discussion through this panel. But before we do that, uh, let me share a few slides just to set the context, just to set the stage, the kind of trends that we are seeing in the market when it comes to cloud. We track a survey that we do on a quarterly basis. And we asked organizations across Asia Pacific about their cloud computing initiatives, their plans over the next uh, 12 months. So as you can see on the chart, India ranks third after Australia and Singapore when it comes to cloud adoption. As 50% of Indian organizations, they are currently using cloud in one form or the other. 34% uh, plan cloud initiatives over the next 12 months. And 16% mentioned that they do not have any plan for cloud. It's quite encouraging to see because we have been tracking, uh, we have been doing this study for almost uh, you know, three or four years, where we have seen uh, you know, the India uh, data, right? The percentage for cloud adoption has increased significantly over the last two years. And uh, definitely, as we move forward, we will see further increase in the cloud adoption for uh, India. Let me take a pause here and ask you all, what do you think, what is the top, what is the key driver for cloud adoption in India? Anyone? Yes, go ahead. Maybe the OPEX model. OPEX model, okay, that's a fair point. Who else? The key driver, why organizations are adopting it? Cost savings. Cost savings, okay. And the ease of implementation. The? Ease of implementation. Ease of implementation, that's a good point. Remote access. Remote access, okay. Speedy implementation. Speedy implementation, okay. Who else? So let's look at some of the drivers, right? based on our research, what we really found. We asked organization about uh, you know, why uh, they are uh, using cloud computing, right? And we use the scale of one to 10, where 10 is highest and one is lowest. What we really found for organizations, 82% of Indian organizations are uh, going for cloud to optimize their existing IT management and automation capabilities. And at the same time, the key business driver is compete more effectively in the marketplace to be more agile, more flexible, and respond to frequent changing business and customer needs in a better, faster, cheaper way. Some other factors that came out from the survey to reduce IT costs, uh, empower the business by simplifying access to IT resources, so on and so forth. But top two factors on the IT side, to have better IT management and automation capabilities and compete more effectively in the marketplace. But at the same time, obviously within cloud we have different models, public, private, and hybrid. So far what we have seen is a good mix of hybrid and private cloud in the market. As close to 70% of organizations, uh, they are likely to focus investments, uh, cloud investments on either hybrid or private cloud. But at the same time, what we are seeing is the gradual increase in uh, public cloud adoption. As 14% of organization mentioned that they plan to invest in public cloud over the next 12 months. One interesting uh, you know, point to look at, this 14%. 14% of Indian organizations are still not very sure whether they are going to opt public, private, hybrid, what's going to be their cloud strategy as they move forward. Another question, this is going to be an obvious one, I know. The top concern that organizations have today to adopt our cloud. Security, yes, I can hear this, yes. Any other reason can you, you can think of? Migration, I think. Migration, that's a good point. Legacy systems? Bandwidth? Okay. Anyone else? 
That's a very good point. Data privacy or loss of control. This is what our data shows, our research shows. When we asked the organization about uh, various concerns that they have to move to cloud. Data privacy or loss of control, 64% of organizations mentioned as a top barrier, top concern for cloud. Some other factors were mentioned like integration. Someone uh, you know, mentioned in the audience, integration with existing on-premise or legacy systems. Security, interestingly, scores third. And some other factors, regulatory availability of performance concerns, fear of vendor lock-in, so on and so forth. So just wanted to set the stage you know, through these slides, the kind of trends that uh, we are seeing in the market when it comes to cloud. So I think we can kick off the panel discussion now. <laughs>